had a YouTube. Um, I was uh, making some searches online today um, how to um, to um, see my screen, my um, my Samsung Galaxy S4 screen on my computer, and there is a lot of options you can do it, but um, most of them they're very uh, complicated. So I came up with um with an easy solution, and I don't know, it's easy for me. It might be easy for you guys as well. So um, it's called uh, Team Viewer. And Team Viewer is a free program. You can um, remote control your screen. You can remote control your uh, your Samsung screen and your computer screen at the same time. So um, I'm gonna go through this and show you guys how to do that. So first, what we need to do is we need to install Team View. You need to install Team View for um, whatever platform you're using. I'm using Windows, so. Um, we need to install is this one, the first one here, all in one. After you have done this, you uh, after install it, and then when you have installed that, just launch it, and you're gonna get this window here showing um, showing your um, your partner ID and your ID and password. You can give this to your partner, and you can connect to your screen. But uh, let's focus on this one. And then after you done all this, you need to go to your Samsung store, and you can search for TeamView. Right, and then uh, you you're gonna get a lot of uh, applications of TeamView, but on this case, you're gonna be downloading uh, TeamView um, TeamViewer Quick Support. So after you've done that, just install it and then launch it. When you launch the program you're gonna get um, an ID so that ID has to be typed in on your on your computer here your partner ID and then you say connect to partner All right, I got, I've got an update sorry about this This is this is not good. <laughs> All right, as I said, guys, um, what you need to do after that, you type in your idea here, and then you say connect your partner, and what it's gonna do is gonna send you a notification on your phone to you, to let you know do you wanna allow this or deny. So in this case, you say allow. And then when you say allow, you get to see everything here, like um, your your CPU usage, your RAM, battery, and you can just send for a print screen. You can see your apps. You can um, anything like settings. And um, so what you want to do now, you want to see your screen on your your phone screen on your computer. So what you do in this case, you you see on the left top corner here, it says remote control. You hit that button, and it's gonna ask you again if you wanna allow this, and you say allow. As you see now, we can see uh, my Samsung um, screen. And from here, what you can do is uh, you can you can control your screen. You can type. You can you can send files on your phone. You can actually do anything here, pretty much everything. As you see, I'm using everything with my mouse. You can. Um, you can browse. You can you can do anything you want. Uh, you can type as well. Let us try this out. As you see, everything I'm doing here is with my mouse. As you see, you can type anything here. All right, guys. Um, yeah, this is pretty much. Um, I think this is the best solution to use your um, your uh, your phone screen on your computer. Like, if you want to type messages and everything like that, like you cannot do them at the same time. So, what you do is um, you just do this option. And um, the the graphic way it's not very very clear, but um, I will still use this. It's very nice. Alright guys, thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe.